Columbia County School District leader is reacting to arrests made after an incident at Evans High School yesterday. Stefan Lee Townsend is facing weapons and trespassing charges. Cameron David Peebles is charged with a fray and trespassing. Hannah Latier joins us now live from the Satellite News Center with more details. That's right, Jenny. A letter sent out to Evans High parents on Tuesday says those two suspects are not students at the school. It says the school's parking lot monitor alerted the school district's police after Townsend and Peebles refused to leave campus during dismissal. He approached the vehicle and asked what they were doing there and they said they were there to pick up, you know, a student or what have you and he re redirected them to the parent or the car line. Um, as he would any car that was not supposed to be there. After initiating a fight, they tried to run away but were stopped by school district police in a nearby parking lot. That's where the letter says police found Townsend had a gun. No verbal threats were made against students or staff. I thought they did a very um, good job, you know, the, from the parking lot attendant up through the SRO and our administration and certainly the students and staff that were involved did what they needed to do and the situation um, as as bad as it was it was cleared up and out. Jackson credits the parking lot monitor a new addition to Columbia County High Schools as one reason the situation panned out the way it did. We've had them at all five of our high schools since the beginning of the school year and they on a daily basis monitor the parking lot the coming and going of students making sure students are getting in and out of their vehicles, um, getting to class, they're monitoring um, deliveries, anything that goes on in that parking lot, there are eyes in our ears. And she wants to send out a reminder to parents. As much as they can educate their children on um, all the different safety measures that they need to have in place. Townsend is being held at the Columbia County Detention Center. Peebles has been released and a police report has not been released yet.